I'd now like to show you how to make some more multiple copies of this particular group of vectors, but this time using block copy rotate. Here we have the dialog box for the block copy rotate, and I'm going to show you the rotate copy first of all. I can change the center of this if I like. I could also drag the crosshairs to whatever point I was desired. For this particular example, I'm going to leave this at 0, 0, so it rotates about the center. And the angle I'm going to use is 360 degrees, so it sweeps this particular group of vectors around a diameter. And the number of objects is going to be 6. And I'll just click Apply. So there you can see it's rotated 6 times around this diameter. So I'll just undo this and instead of rotate copy I'm going to go on to block copy. I'm going to select the X gap as say 15 and the Y gap as 15. Number of columns let's say 3 and number of rows 3 and just apply that and there you can see it's created 9 copies. If I just center that I could apply this again and it would copy the same thing again. See there we have lots of different copies. I could also center that there. So we have quite a lot of copies there.